Greetings, this is Xiao from Yangpu International. This is the fifth episode of YIC short video series, A New Vision of Danzhou and Yangpu, which demonstrates the increasing internationalization of the Danzhou-Yangpu economic circle. Under the Hainan Fresh Report, and explores new developments of the third pole of Hainan's high-quality economic development. Today, we will talk about international trade. In the Hainan Fresh Report, Trade is one of the key words of development. In May 2022, a key step was made in the construction of the Hainan Fruit Report. When the CPC Hainan Provincial Committee and the government of Hainan Province decided to promote the integrated development of Danzhou and Yangpu regarding to the direction of integrated development, a policy system which places the focus of the Hainan Fruit Report on trade and investment liberalization will be established first to accumulate the requisite experience for independent island-wide custom clearance operation before the end of 2025. In terms of industrial development, the plan proposes to support Danzhou and Yangpu in creating three 100 billion level business model, including business services for international trade. In 2022, Yangpu was entrusted with its new mission of playing the role of one of the first high-level open pilot project for cross-border trade and investment in China. As a key link in the new dual-cycle domestic and international development chain, the DYEC is well placed in the intersection of the new Western Land Sea Corridor and the 21st century Maritime Silk Road. Industries supporting the commodity trade, such as international trade, international logistics, and bulk commodities, has also achieved industrial aggregation in the DYEC. With dozens of leading future 500 companies such as PetroChina, CND Group, and Sinochem International Corporation settling in the DYEC. We welcome more high-quality trading companies to develop their business in the DYEC and share in the future investment dividends of the Hainan Fruit Report.